Hi guys, so today I'm going to be doing my November favorites and first product has to be my NYX Glide On Eyeliner and I actually got recommended this by one of you guys. I remember seeing a comment um, about trying the NYX Glide On pencils and I remember Holly and Array talked about it and I've heard really good things about them so I finally picked it up at Ulta. I think actually it was last month but I really didn't get into using it a whole lot until really November is when I started using it. So I've really been liking this and so creamy and pigmented and oh my goodness I want to go back and try all the colors because I've really been enjoying that. Okay next product I have really been liking this month is doing my brows and I've always been a fan of doing my brows just because I think it really frames your face. So I've been into that and I've been using my NYX eyebrow cake powder which I got at Ulta a long time ago and I never really liked it actually. I liked the wax but I felt like the powders were too dark. Um, just for my eyebrows it would always turn out way too much darker than I would want and unnatural looking but I've just been using a really light hand at it. So I'll take this little eyeliner from Chanel. It's the 14, number 14 eyeliner brush. Um, it's like an angled really super fine brush and I'll just take this and take barely a little powder like barely any powder and then fill in my brows with that, just fill in the little empty spaces I have in my eyebrows and then take the wax and go over the wax on my eyebrows and it just really really like the look of it and it just makes my eyebrows look full but kind of natural looking and not too crazy cholo like harsh looking so I really like this and I am in the shade brunette. Um, and I know they have different shades too. So love this. I would definitely recommend checking it out if you guys are in to like that full eyebrow effect, which I really like. Okay, so next item is a blush and this is from Wet n Wild. It's from the Color Icon Blushers in the shade Pearlescent Pink. And I picked this up at Ulta a while ago um, and I've just really been liking the color. And the product is really hard to work with, I feel, because it's very powdery. So you just do like one swipe on my brush and the brush is like caked with it. Um, and it just kind of goes everywhere. So it's a little messy to work with. Um, but I love the color on my cheeks. It just gives a really nice flush of pink. And that is what I'm wearing on my cheeks today along with bronzer and highlighter and stuff. Okay, so last two beauty favorites are something that you guys, if you've been watching me for a while, you know that I am obsessed with these two products and just the combination they give. For the past, I would say maybe six months or so, I have been wearing BB cream and BB cream is like my new favorite product in the world. Like I feel like I'll never go back to wearing foundation really just because BB cream is just amazing. It's great for my skin. It hydrates it. It looks like flawless. Like it doesn't even look like you have makeup on. Um, but it's very, very light. Um, so I just love it. it. This is the Maybelline Dream Fresh BB cream. You guys know I've talked about this all the time. And I like pairing it with my Maybelline Dream Matte Powder. I'm a big like Maybelline foundation products because before my BB cream I was using my um, Fit Me foundations which I still use off and on but those are definitely more full coverage and kind of can get a little bit cakey but I'm telling you this BB cream along with the Dream Matte powder are like the perfect face combination. So that's pretty much it for like my main beauty products. I really haven't tried a ton of makeup. I've just kind of been into, I don't really know what I've been into, maybe fashion more than trying beauty products recently. Um, besides this next one, this was like the only new product I've really tried and enjoyed this month. So I guess I'll just move on to a couple of my favorite nail polishes for this month. Okay, first favorite has been a favorite for a long time and I should probably just include this in like every favorites video because I absolutely love it. And this is my Essie Fiji polish. And I'm so sad because it's getting kind of thick and old and it's hard to apply when it's really thick like that. So probably will have to pick up a new one soon even though I still have like half left. But seriously love this color. It's just a pale creamy and it's really pigmented um, baby pink color. Okay so now that we're getting more into the holiday time, a red polish is like a staple for me. This is the one that I've been wearing on my nails all the time. If you see me wearing a red this season, it's probably this color. This is by OPI and it's in the shade Red Hot Airs Rock. So love this color along with Fiji. Definitely my 
favorite polishes for November. Okay, so favorite fashion piece for this month, hands down, has to be this necklace collar that is total. okay, it's not tangled anymore, just kidding. Anyways, it's like a collar necklace, and I got this on lulus.com. Um, I showed you guys in my previous haul, haul, collective fashion haul, I think, and it's just a really pretty necklace, and the colors are very wearable, so you could just kind of throw it on with any dress or any shirt, um, and it just adds a really pretty pop of color and just a little spice to your outfit. So I really like this one a lot. I have a few other collar necklaces, but this one, hands down, probably has to be my favorite one. So I've been loving pairing this with just some shirts or dresses, and it just kind of adds a little pop to your outfit. So I've been loving that collar necklace. Okay, so the last fashion piece that I want to share with you guys are little chunky booties. And I have been loving wearing these, especially to work because where I work I have to dress business casual um, every day. I work Monday through Friday so it's fun for me because I really like to dress up so and I have so many clothes that allow me to just like dress up and for fun and I have to anyways because that's part of my um my um what's it called Ward wardrobe my wardrobe at work is business casual so booties are definitely a must for me just because they can be casual, but also I like to kind of dress them up a little bit. And then this pair is from it. This black pair is from Lulu's, and they are the Chelsea booties. And they're just so comfortable. Obviously, they're black, and they're not too high, so they go with literally almost every outfit I wear, so I've been wearing those nonstop. And then these little booties are from Shoe Mint, and these are the Esther booties um, and they have a little higher chunky heel but still super comfortable and easy to walk in so I've been loving pairing these with pretty much all my outfits just because they're like neutral colors and they go with a lot um, so that is pretty much it for my November favorites also I forgot to mention in the beginning of the video I do this thing on my vlog channel which is a favorites but on my vlog channel and it includes pretty much all of my favorites for that month but nothing beauty or fashion related so it's like my favorite songs of that month my favorite artists my favorite tv show movies that i've been watching foods y'all know me and my foods are like this so i pretty much include foods every single month and just random little favorites so i will have that link down below i'll try to have it up before this video so if you guys want to see a little little another side of me that's not like fashion and beauty um, and just other random stuff, then I will link that video, and like I said, that'll be up on my vlog channel. So I think that's pretty much it, and I'll see you guys very soon in my next video. Bye, everyone!